Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. It's Jo from Plan to Create. Doing another plan with me uh, this week in my Hobonichi cousin in the weekly section. I still have my cousin in my Giulio Aponto in grey croco mat. And it's just started to rain, so uh, you may hear that. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, yeah, so we're still in here. Um, I have my reference book now in my uh, Louis Vuitton desk agenda, but I will be changing that. I've ordered um, something different to put in this, so I'll show you when that arrives. Okay, so we'll get into it. What am I looking for? I'm looking for my weekly. Here we are. So we'll be going from the 30th of March to the 5th of April. This is the week so far. Uh, today's Sunday. I'm running behind uh, this week. And during the week, we hit 1,000 subscribers on YouTube. So thank you so much. <clears throat> I was extremely excited. Okay. So, we're using a kit from one of my faves, which is uh, a printable kit from Plan for Happy on Etsy. I will link the shop down below. This is actually a Hobonichi Cousin kit. So, it's little flamingos. It's just, they're so cute. They're adorable. Uh, so, uh, we have the washi, some glitter, uh, to do headers you get such a good array of different stickers um, on this kit wait one second okay I'm back okay so we've got our Hobonichi sized kit and I've got a couple of posty notes here just to remind me of things going on during the week now obviously this would have been the start of the school holidays, but they actually started last week due to uh, current circumstances. So I don't have a lot on, but we'll first pop down our date covers. Now this is the first time I've used um, a kit specifically sized for the cousin. I normally use Erin Condren kits that I can um, reduce down. So we'll see how this goes. And as you can see, they fit perfectly. They are quite big, so you lose a little bit of space um, underneath, but that's fine. So I'll just writing that date there so I don't forget and I normally put in some sort of decorative box over here so I think I will use this one here where are we little flamingo So I'll pop that in there just to cover that up. And then I am going to put down a This Week sticker. So we have some washi strips here. So I'm going to put them right down the bottom. And again, these are sized for the cousin so you don't have any issues with the Erin Condren size down depending on the kit um, you can have some issues with your sizing oh, um, of the washi so you can be required to cut it down a little bit and that's crooked but I'm not going to get it any better than that so that's okay Okay, so we have, where is it, where is it, where is it, weekend banner. And normally I pop it right up the top 
um, which I will lose. Sorry, I was out of frame then. I pop it up the top here. So I'll lose a little bit more space um, due to the date covers being bigger, but that's okay. All right, now I normally also put down some little check boxes just to mark down the important things for the day. So I will pop those down now. Okay, so we've had to pop those ones down a little bit lower. I probably should have put that weekend banner down the bottom, but that's okay. All right, so a couple of things that we've got this week. Tuesday morning, um, I have a doctor's appointment. So I'm going to mark that with a little half box here. Tuesday. I don't know if anybody else suffers from acid reflux, but just lately it has been, <clears throat> excuse me, excruciating. Uh, so I um I need to go get that sorted out. So I'll pop that in there. And Wednesday. Currently everybody is supposed to be staying home. Uh, which I hope everybody is and is well and safe. But my electricity company has decided Wednesday that we're going to have no power for half the day. So I might use a bigger box. And it is from 12 o'clock till 4. So I'll pop it in around that time. So sorry, 12.30. So 12 30 to 4 p.m. No power. So, and due to that, the night before, I'm going to pop down a box to remind me to charge everything so I don't run out, and especially for my son. Um, so, charge Oh, I didn't put it on the wrong day. See? There we go. Try again. Charge everything. Because <laughs> there's nothing worse than not being able to watch some Netflix or something when you've got no power in the house. Okay, so... We need to mark some happy mail. So I'll just show you this sheet. You get lots and lots of icons and script. Um, they're really good actually. So there is a happy mail sticker here. And I'll pop that in there so I can write in what I have coming. And because we are staying home, um, like my son needed some clothes because he's growing, he's 11, uh, but he's growing like a maniac. So <laughs> he's grown out of all his, all his clothes. So I've ordered them online this time and it's the first time I've done that. So keep your fingers crossed that they all fit. Okay, so Mondays, I normally put a little sticker somewhere um, for like a highlight of the day. So I'm going to squish them where I can. So we've got coffee there. Uh, bin day for Tuesday. These are just little, little reminders um, of my routines, so to speak. Uh, Wednesdays is washing day, and I know there is a, there normally is a washing basket. Yep. Uh, Thursdays I put down a computer and Fridays is filming so I'm going to pop down this little tiny little film 
and pop that there. Excuse my squeaky chair. I really need to get a new one. Okay, so we don't have payday this week. It's the following. Uh, what else do we have on here? Okay, I'm going to put down a little Hello Monday on here. The colours of this kit are just gorgeous. They're so bright. Love it. Okay. All right, now I think that will probably do for my bare bones for this week. And as I go, I'll fill out my day and then with any spaces in between, I can pop in some sort of icons for deco or some script. Oops, I'm out of frame again, sorry. Uh, or pop in some script. There's some little mo motivational quotes and things in here as well. So, uh, which is great. <clears throat> okay, so that's the bare bones. And this week, as I said, I fill out the day. And then if I have gaps, I just go in and pop some, some stickers in here and there just to sort of um, fill it up. Because we are at home... Um, there's not a lot going on uh, to put in our planners, unfortunately. But um, another thing you could do if you have lots of space left is just put a little journal entry in of, you know, what you did that day. Um, with my dailies, I started using um, one day per page to give that a try. But it, as you can see... I lasted two days. Um, normally I have two days per page. Um, I still haven't filled out this side for yesterday um, or filled out any for today, but that's okay. Um, so, yeah, that's how I'm utilising that. And I'm not using, because I'm normally doing two days per page, this is the 25th of February and we are at the 29th of March. So I'm going to have plenty of pages for notes and things uh, as I go along. So, yeah. Alrighty. So we'll leave that. Where are we? We'll leave that as that for the start for this week. Thank you very much for stopping by again. I really appreciate it. Love it if you could give it a thumbs up and subscribe. And for those who already have subscribed, thank you so much. And I will see you again next week with another video. Bye.